Welcome to a very special episode of the Artist Corner. Here we're going to spotlight artist Trent Koniga. The first time I came across Trent uh, was on his YouTube. I was still new to the digital art, had no idea what I was doing. I got a Cintiq companion to help me with my comic book art during the Until We Sleep days. That book would have taken so much longer had it not been for the tablet that, uh, that I had. So then through searching, I found his tutorial um, on Sketchbook Pro. I'll, I'll link the uh, video in the description. I would have been lost if it had not been for this video. After watching Trent for a while, I began to see him as a teacher. I never liked the term self-taught artist because we don't teach ourselves, we learn from others. Formally taught would be a better term. Through his tutorials and his in-depth breakdowns, I learned the wealth of knowledge from Trent. I wanted to make this video to show his progression from indie comic creator to one of the best YouTube artists out there, and even more as head of his own art house, The Aquatic Moon. Trent Conigo was raised in Indiana, and at the age of 16 he self-published his creator-owned comic, Creed. Early on, Trent was very adept in stylization, something he was known for for his uh, titular title. This success opened the door for other avenues in the art world, briefly entering the fashion world working for the brand J Co. He would parlay this into concept art. Trent is well known for his concept art sharing on Instagram the concept art that got him to be the artist on Ghostwriter for Marvel. The clouds of Blizzard would soon consume Trent, leading to a prosperous career at Blizzard Entertainment, where he worked on Diablo 3. He would find further success with games like League of Legends and Final Fantasy Streetwise. Today, Trent has his own art house called Aquatic Moon, where he has a stable of artists, including himself, work on AAA titles, indie video game titles, and create our own properties like Twilight Monk. I hope this brief video is entertaining, educational, and inspirational. The whole point of these videos is to show my appreciation for these artists and also give the next generation a goal to reach for. Never stay stagnant, always persevere, and all good things will come. Trent was nice enough to give me the okay to do this video on him. In the description below you can check out Aquatic Moon, Trent's YouTube channel, and his Gumroad. Thank you so much for watching. And I really do hope this helped a lot. Um, and you can show some love to Trent uh, through these various links. Um, I personally got his gum road. Um, and it, his brushes have been uh, really, really great for, um, for my iPad art. So now I kind of went from Cintiq to the uh, iPad Pro. Um, and just take it from me, the tutorials alone is worth its weight in gold. So... I want to thank Trent for allowing me to do this. Um, I want to also list some of the links um, and sources that I used. I used the Aquatic Moon website, uh, Cree Guy Blogspot, um, some of YouTube's um, on Trent's YouTube channel, uh, rather, and his Gumroad. So I hope you guys really enjoy this. And as always, don't forget to keep it over at 9,000. Take care.